Today's the day, you got some main events going on. Should be good. And uh, hopefully we can take a title. So uh, let's go out there and shut it up. Over here, get one down, one more to go. It's all tied up coming into this, right? Yes. Going into it, 2-1. Uh, Dax going in 1-2, so whoever beats each other gets the title. Ooh. Yeah, man, for sure. These guys are uh, putting it down. Their lap times are up, up, up in classes. So they're, I think, both very dialed in, focused. It's going to come down to executing. Both of them are ready, and they know what they need to do. So good race is what we're going to see. Bumper Maddox, the kid who uh, works on his own bikes, does all his own stuff, all his own training, all everything, and uh, his bike just blew up, which sucks because the kid's been putting in so much work. Kid that got a lot faster by just working super hard, so um, definitely uh, needs to have some recognition for sure. Uh, was it radiator fluid? Oh. Broke the studs, huh? Too much compression or something, dude. That sucks. Well, his head came apart on his bike. That sucks, man. This is a kid that works hard and deserves it to do good. Older kid that's a good influence on Hayden, you know? It's pretty rare nowadays. Hayden's up in a couple more motos, and you never know how he's going to do. Jack's pretty beat up. They brought him good luck his first photo. Really? Yep. Thanks. Tell him to get the whole shot. Get the whole shot. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Number one, baby. Let's see. Blood charm. Got an assortment of uh, some fruits and veggies for you guys. Please eat up for your motto. Thanks. You feel how hot my hair is. Feel, feel it. Feel how hot his hair is. It's about 103 degrees right there. Oh, that's not good. Dude, I could cook a patty on that. Moto 3. He's digging Dax and Bannock. It's going down. So hot, man. I just gotta make sure the gate's good. It's like my job. Yeah. It's all good. The hotter the better for Aiden. Let them, the tough kids, rise to the top.
giving up, you know? So either Jackson should win this one, which is cool. It's his buddy, so that's good. <laughs> pretty bad start and worked my way up to about seventh first lap. I saw my son here on the ground. Uh, slid out over this jump. I was like, crap, that sucks, but uh, ended up with a win. How'd it go, Hayden? I don't know, kind of got a little squirrely, kind of slid and wadded, so got back up. My bars were like completely straight, like sideways, so I had to go by Tyler. He knocked them straight for me. Not really, though. They're still kind of really crooked, <laughs> but uh, I just tried to race my race and uh, finish instead of quitting so uh overall went pretty good cool where yeah. do you get the merch shop 38com subscribe subscribe to digging 38 hold on let me get it on paper those oreos pretty good chandler pretty good <laughs> Sorry. thanks for the oreos digging <laughs> secret sauce in them they make you go make fast. you go fast i love that but yeah um so today was a lot of hard work a lot of dedication a lot of practice a lot of uh, you know, just working on the bikes, testing, and then all came down to this day of three moto format. Uh, Dax won the first one, Hayden won the second moto, and then going to this last one, Hayden gets first gate pick. You know, it's uh, kind of up to whoever wins this moto wins the championship. And Hayden kicks, picks the first gate, and they all line up. Hayden, you know, they take off. He gets a decent start, He's somewhere in the top five, but they just prepped the track, so it was pretty muddy and. and um, Fully groomed smooth, which I really don't like. It's better when it's rough and ruddy because Hayden seems to be better like that. But it changed the game up to where the first lap was muddy and slick and I think Hayden just got so aggressive in his riding that he dove into the inside to try to pass these two kids and he went up the face and the face was just shiny wet. To me, he should have saw that on the parade lap that that face was slick and he went up and tried to like pass his kid and ended up sliding in. Indoing, I saw it from the stands. I was over on the side of the track. I just seen pink gear indoing and crashing. I was like, oh, I was like, yelled, I was bummed. You know, I think I was just bummed because I wanted to see a race. I wanted to see him and 
you know, Dax Ballot out for the win. I thought that would be really cool. Uh, but you look at racing, many years, many days of racing, many, many, uh, you know, uh, races will come and go. But with him, that moto, I really want to see him win it. But hey, that was, he made went in, made a bad decision, in my opinion, went inside in the mud and tried to, tried to push the issue too early. He should have waited. Um, but he's young, you know, it's a good thing. It's hard to teach a kid aggression. It's easier to pull it pull it back. So I can't really get too upset about it, you know? It's really just, you know, it happened. And then he got up, bars were bent, everything was bent. So he had to pull in the mechanics area and straighten everything. He finished race, which I was cool with that. Like, I'd like to see him not give up, even though it was done. He still finished the race, um, you know, came up, which was important, you know, because you got to be a good winner and you got to be a good loser. Like, so these are things you, te uh, morals you teach your kid in life that, you know, he pulls off the track, you know, um, Dax comes up, you know, wins the race, and he's like, hey, good job to his buddy. I think he genuinely was stoked for him, you know, just like, yeah, cool, you know, and it wasn't like a big drama, um, you know, head down, crying or nothing. It was like, there's gonna be more races, a ton of them, and he's gonna battle with Dax throughout his whole career, hopefully, you know, and, and uh, hopefully they stay friends, which I think they're showing a lot of other kids that it's okay to be friends and race with each other. We're not even to the money game yet, like at all. So it doesn't what's it really matter, like right now. Um, and then you get to the pro ranks, and there's so many rides for the kids that really want it. Um, so anyway, today was kind of a moral, like a, you know, learning the moral of life that you win some, you lose some, stuff happens. Hopefully, he learned from that mistake, and we don't make it again. We'll be back here many more years. Hopefully, he does not. <laughs> go inside after they water on that jump. We watched so many people crash on that jump over the years and, and, and it got him. Uh, but uh, overall, I feel like he took it well. Um, he's amped up, ready to go for the main event tomorrow. And uh, I think he's gonna sit, uh, lay it down tomorrow.